Welcome to the Law of Definite Proportions. This lesson is the first part of a sequence that describes the laws that govern or determine how chemical formulas are put together. The Law of Definite Proportions states that a compound always forms from a fixed ratio of elements. Let's take a look at what that means using water as an example. So the Law of Definite Proportions basically states that water, as a compound, will always form from the same ratio of hydrogen and oxygen. Specifically, that water is formed from two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen. So this is always the ratio of hydrogen atoms to oxygen atoms in any sample of water. But the law also holds true for the mass. So if we look at the mass of hydrogen, it's two AMUs, because it's one AMU per hydrogen and there are two of them. The mass for oxygen is going to be 16 AMUs. And so now I can look at the ratio for hydrogen and oxygen in water. I can say that the mass ratio of oxygen to hydrogen in water is 16 to 2. And that simplifies to a ratio of 8 to 1 by mass. What this mass ratio tells us is that any sample of water, whether it be a single droplet of water, or a cup of water, or an ocean, the mass of oxygen present in that water is going to be eight times that of the mass of hydrogen in that water. And that is the law of definite proportions. That wraps up our lesson. Write down any questions you have in your notes and bring them with you to class.